हेलो गाइस दिस इज राजन आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट अ वेरी हैप्पी दसरा टू ऑल एंड सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डू अ निफ्टी एनालिसिस फॉर द अपकमिंग वीकेंड एंड सी व्हाट कैन बी डन एंड हाउ वी कुड ट्रेड ओके सो बेसिकली व्हाट हैज हैपेंड हियर इन दिस निफ्टी ट्रेडर्स दिस इज अ मेजर सपोर्ट व्हिच गॉट ब्रोकन एंड यू कैन सी दैट देयर वाज अ ड्रास्टिक फॉल एंड देन even this a uh, huge support was also broken and it went down and you know the market was falling the last week and the previous one when la- from last um, probably you could say from 22 september the market has been a little bearish so what can be done now uh, we were waiting in our community i think i posted it here so we were waiting for this trend line uh, to break okay only if nifty breaks out of this trend line uh, we become bullish and uh, yeah uh, that is what happened because uh, when nifty was around here few were confused whether to go long or short because there was a huge right there was a huge candle but again it uh, uh, this i wouldn't call a retrace this is definitely a reversal uh, because it is as drastic as this move correct so uh, i was cautious and uh, look at this this is a tr- simple trend line right uh, how many times it has taken a rejection look at this this is a very simple line right uh, but if you carefully notice it has taken you could have taken at least two to three trades just out of this trend line you don't want anything no indicators just using price action you can trade for example uh, when it is broken you could have put your stop loss even if you have taken a short here uh, when this is a huge one hour candle and put your stop loss below this you would have made money or when it uh, pulled back you could have taken a short uh, with a stop loss on top of this there were a plenty of opportunities to go short yes i did take one short trade in this and it was not huge i didn't allocate much uh, whenever i short trades i don't allocate huge uh, because of few reasons uh, and then this happened and uh, yeah i mean this day we did make money uh, because of uh, this breakout i guess right uh, we also posted this on our community and we did make some some money out of it right and then after this breakout i didn't i, I closed it right here on friday i didn't even wait up to this point i didn't like this wick so i closed it here and uh, and then the next chart was this i was not willing to take a uh, long trade unless if it is breaking this uh, line okay so what next so these are the things which could have been done last week Uh, just using price action i'm not using volume moving averages any indicators uh, just a simple trend lines and uh, discipline to sit and wait for the opportunity uh, you can de- make a decent out, uh, you know income out of it so here uh, uh, as you guys know that <coughs> the us market uh, trended like anything yesterday and uh, the uh, since 2020 uh, this is like the most two day gain okay in spx and uh, so what could happen is there is going to be a, a good gap up and uh, hopefully uh, there is going to be a bullish trade i hope it doesn't gap up so much okay because if it gaps up so much it could fill the gap and then move we have to wait and see what is going to happen uh, this is a trend line that you may need to watch out okay um, let's say <laughs> exactly here it is opening then you have to wait cool or if it is opening around here uh, you have to wait and see if if this area is uh, you know is broken and then after that we can look for some kind of a, a long trade so yeah this is what my plan is uh, if it is breaking out i will trade uh, if it is gapping down i mean not if the gap up is like only around this area i will go long uh, until this point uh if it is gapping up r- exactly uh exactly at this area 494 or 500 i would not go long because this is a huge resistance uh what could happen is uh, it could take a resistance and you know go sideways for one or two days or even hours i don't know no one knows that 
if there is a huge huge candle a uh, red color candle uh, with a wick on top of it definitely i will go short also uh, it could test this area again and go so let's see how it goes and i'm quite bullish and uh, yeah i mean i won't mind to go short as well and as far as mcdowell is concerned uh, what you can do is you can just hold um, based on my previous video if you look at it uh, there was a very good uh, movement and if you did make money please comment if you made money in mcdowells i would be happy to know how many made money okay uh, if i want to know if people are really using my videos Uh, okay and uh, it was a very uh, in the in the previous video i told you that if there is a breakout either you could go long here or if there is a breakout uh, from this uh, triangle pattern you could go long so exactly this is what has happened and um, yeah um you can uh, cash holders you can definitely hold it and if you are holding on options and futures obviously there is going to be a continuation in uh, buying momentum i suppose so yeah uh, i hope you guys made money and uh, if you want to trade stocks like this please do not mind to join my jft membership there is an offer going on today uh, use jft puja uh, to enroll yourself 2000 rupees offer and this ends by today okay uh, thank you so much for watching this video with patience and uh, see you soon with another video